everyone and welcome to Red United TV. It's your boy Ivor and Spice back at it again with another match reaction. And remember guys, if you're new to the channel, remember to subscribe, smash that like button and remember to share because sharing Ivor and Spice is caring. Boom! And today guys, whew, it's Roma 3, Manchester United 2. Manchester United losing the battle but winning the war. Finally breaking their semi-finals hoodoo by finally reaching the finals of a competition. Yes, Manchester United are through to the Europa League final. Yes, here we come. Let's see if the boys can do it. Let's see if the boys can finally lift a trophy. Let's see if Oli himself can win a trophy. And boy, oh boy, oh boy. If he doesn't win a trophy, ah, <laughs> out, straight up, head cut off. But guys, Manchester United reaching that European final. And yes, yes, we have a chance again to win a European trophy. Um, I'm looking forward for us actually trying to do this and make this happen. Brilliant play by a couple of the players such as Cavani in the match. Big up to Bruno with his assist. Fred played well. Big up to David De Gea in that match because he was absolutely superb. He blocked everything. He was having it today, guys. He, nah, he was, he was like, bro, big man thing. I'm going to make some saves. I'm going to show Ali that I still got it, you know. But yeah, we did concede goals today and we did lose the game. So, boy, if Henderson probably was playing, maybe we will not concede that much of goals. But yeah, you never know. But, Nevertheless, Manchester United are through, guys. They are through to the finals. Here we come. Hopefully, we can win our trophy. It's been a long time coming, you know. Boom. Let's just let's just pray, let's just pray that we do this right, you know. Because I know Oli can go there with some messed up game plan and f this shit up, you know. F everything up, and then after that is Oli out, Oli out, Oli out training. So don't mess yourself up. Before you wreck yourself, you know, check yourself before you wreck yourself, guys. But yes, guys, let's go straight into that game. Edison Cavani, El Matador, aka Tarzan, aka Mowgli, aka Jungle Book. You get me? Cavani, star of the show today, two goals for him. Starting off with that first goal, Cavani with a brilliant goal coming from a brilliant breakaway from the lads. Good first time pass by Fred, setting him up with Fred for the assist, which I have to say, in the first half, Fred was tremendously playing well. He was unstoppable. He was mm, on it. But yes, El Matador making it 1-0. And of course, half-time, Manchester United looking good, looking good in the final third of the first half, making that raw. Second half, it's going to be easy. Yes, Roma weren't having it in the second half. Trust me, first goal conceding, and then Jerko that pum pum again. And then Jerko, do you like scoring against us? Is there a thing against us? Do you have do you have a fetish towards scoring against Manchester United? Because all of a sudden, for Man City to Roma, you scored last week, you're scoring again, practicing that old traffic a couple of years ago, and now again. You really don't like us, innit? You really do. Burn you because your team is out. And again, Roma making it 2-1 with Pastor Fred doing too much preaching with the ball, losing it to the a player of Roma. Roma scoring a brilliant goal as well. Brilliant strike by the ups. Peppering David De Gea from a distance as well, which I have to say, big ups to Roma because they did a thing. El Matador again, poof, with a second goal. Brilliant header by El Matador. Lovely cross by Bruno Fernandes with another assist from Bruno. He just, number just keeps going up. That stat paneling just keeps going up. He's, his value keeps going. Ching, 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 ching. That guy costs peas now, you know. Really season so far for Bruno Fernandes in terms of statistics. Performance-wise, eh. Roma making it 3-2, scoring again. Of course, like I said before, they may have won the battle, but you did not win the war. We did, guys. So, Manchester United, three, two, full time. Manchester United going through. Manchester United fans are happy. Hallelujah! We are through. We're out. We are doing our thing now. 
we've we got a trophy to be preparing for. Look at me, I'm gas. You never know because why? We might lose the final to Villarreal. Also, ha ha, Arsenal. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> Ooh. And you men got not the fuck up. Simple as. Simple as like it's a Friday, but it is Thursday, you know. Ah, uh, we all thought it was going to be a all English affair final in Europe for the Europa League and also the Champions League. Big ups to Man City and Chelsea for making it to the Champions League. You men did your thing. Yeah, I hope you guys do sign and, and, and make a very good match. And I'm hoping that, well, I, would still, I don't even care who wins. All I've got to say is that Manchester United have got things to learn from. And, and when they see the team win the Champions League, they should be hungry for that. But guys, I am so pleased that we're, th we're through to the finals. Man of the match today, guys, has to go to David De Gea. Brilliant saves. I could have given it to Cavani and Metodo. But apart from that, I thought David De Gea saved us so many times, you know. Brilliant saves as well. You know, he kept he kept Roma at bay at times, you know. It could have been worse than what the school line was. You never know. We could have got knocked out. But, bro, big ups David De Gea. Manchester United, Alex. Get ready for a party because Arsenal won't be joining us, you know. You know, party himself hasn't been able to party ever since lockdown came through. You know, now that lockdown's open, there's no clubs open though. So party can't really party. So I feel sorry for you Arsenal fans. Uh, but it feels good to be in the final again in Europe as well, guys. Guys, I'm not going to lie to you. This has been your match reaction by I foreign spies because I am tired. Oh, man, 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 man. I'm tired, but ecstatic, guys. Guys, you let me know who your man in the match was because I don't have no donkey in the match because we are through. Also, let me know what you thought of the match as well, guys. And also, remember as well to follow the official Instagram account of Red United TV, which is Red United TV. One, baby. And also the official TikTok account, which is Red United TV. And do remember to follow my personal Instagram account, which is Ivorian underscore Spice, across the Twitter and also across the Snapchat. And guys, I am tired, man. You can see my red eye. It's been a long day. Make sure you check out the United podcast on Bits and Buzz. Remember to subscribe to Bits and Buzz. Last but not least, remember to smash that like button. Remember to share. Remember to subscribe as well. And also, my ladies, my ladies, as you are the one that watched my videos all the way to the end, because you man them always fall off at some point. You probably make it to the two minutes. All in one minute, because you man's are one minute, man, in general, innit? You get me? But, ladies, back to you. Remember to share to your ex-boyfriend. Remember to share to your current boyfriend. Remember to share to your pastor that I've been trying to move to. You. Slightly on a low key, you know, inviting to prayer meetings at his house inappropriately. Remember to share to your guy that's been trying to move to you at the bus stop and then you keep on telling him, I got a man, but he keeps on telling you that, but your butt is though, I don't even care. And remember to share to the guy that's been trying to move to you to at the, at the train station and be telling you that, raw fam, you know, we can always be friends though, but you're there telling them, I've got plenty of friends, thank you, thank you very much. At the same time, remember to share to the guy that's been offering you Free food at work all of the time. And remember to share the link to the guy that's been trying to offer you free chicken wings at Chicken Shop. Also, ask for your number. But you gave him your Snapchat, which is calm. You know, remember to share to your dad's friends that be saying, My oh, my oh, my babe, you have grown. Because when you share that and they ask you, What's this? Tell them you find a man that does it way better than you. And that's Ivory Spice on the Red United channel. I'm out and peace out.